Greetings and welcome to the new season 2024 Commerza Radio Worldwide Online. The mind, the journey, the destiny. We are back with the new show, Business Academy show dedicated to specific themes at the workplaces. Every Tuesday of the week, from 1900 hours to 2000 hours South Africa Standard Time, we shall be putting spotlight on these topics. We will identify a particular course within our menu of offerings and engage with the members, friends, business associate of Cometa, and you, the listeners. And this evening, the 6th of February, 2024, we will be putting spotlight on the topic, accountability at the workplace. And I'm with my common guests or friends, members, and business associates of Cometa, George Mutenta Zamera and Dolores Mashishi. They will be taking you through the conversation this evening. Uh, greetings, uh, colleagues. What can we expect this evening? in this inaugural show, Dolores. Wow. Um, Sam, thank you uh, very much for the invite to, to speak on this very important topic. And I'm sure between me and my, my colleague, George, we'll, we'll, we'll really enjoy and, and, and hope to have fun with the, with the listeners. But accountability in the workplace, um, why not? Because we, we focus on the workplace, however, accountability affects all aspects of our lives, really. How many times have we spoke about how do we hold our government accountable? How do we hold ourselves accountable? Um, and in the midst of this, you know, we 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 ask these questions, man, trying to find out what does accountability mean? You know, what does it mean to me? What does it mean to the next person? How do you hold ourselves accountable? It's a very big topic that is um, at this point in the mouthpiece of, of, of everyone and not just in the workplace, in our businesses, everyday lives, where we, where we work, um, if, if you are an entrepreneur, and um, it's, it's in, our, in, in the boards that, uh, that, that people sit in, how do we hold boards accountable? So the word accountability is so much in our, in our mouths. And this is an opportunity now to really look at why is this word so topical? what it means, and how do we make it um, work, work, work with it in the workplace. Um, and, and I'm hoping that uh, we'll enjoy it, yeah. Indeed, indeed. It's a huge, huge need that we have uh, in all spaces. I do agree with you. And George, uh, you could even expand into any other area other than the workplace, but uh, I know you're very passionate about this kind of topics. And uh, you being the Mr. Goal Setting, you, I'm sure you will not uh, end talking about accountability without touching on the SMART goals. What can we hear from your side uh, this evening, uh, George? Yes, uh, as Donald said, it's a very, very important uh, subject of accountability. And uh, she mentions the question, what is it? And I'm sure all the listeners would want to hear what is accountability. But more important would is, is what are the benefits of it? Now I know what accountability is, but what does it give me? Why should I uh, insist on accountability in the workplace? And so from, from my angle, I've always said that uh, a place that has a workplace that has accountability as, as you can see by the fruit, which is improved performance. By the fruit, you shall see them. So a place that has accountability will definitely has as a consequence improved uh, performance and inspiring confidence in the employees and stakeholders, because we know what to expect, expect from this entity. And in the process, of course, we improve connections uh, between the employees and, and stakeholders. I, I'm really quite passionate about taking uh, the subject of accountability, not only into the workplace, but 
into our daily lives because it affects then the, the outcomes of the goals that we set for ourselves. And as you mentioned, tonight we'll talk a little bit about goals because I think that's a very, very important aspect of life. In the, that's our compass, yeah? That is the compass. You've got to have goals to direct your Beautiful. path. Beautiful. I can't wait to welcome you in the studio this evening at 1900 hours South Africa Standard Time. And how wonderful it is that we're going to kick off this series, weekly series, with the two of you. And, and I'm sure the listeners can't wait too. I look forward to welcome you and thank you very much for your time for now. Goodbye. Thank you.